Hello everybody, this is Abby, your average everyday gamer girl host of Creatively Lazy, and this is the first episode of the Creatively Lazy Abby Let's Play, I guess? Yep, we're gonna go ahead and call this the CL Let's Play 2018, yeah. We're gonna go over here to More World Options, turn on cheats, because you can't be creatively lazy if you can't in get into creative mode, right? And, hmm, let's do this. We'll do this, why not? How about that? Oh my, did the game actually not hate me? Is that a thing that has happened? Oh no, this is so cool. So yeah, the plains are some of my favorite biomes to build in. So that's really ex super exciting. Let's see, I've got a savanna over there. That's awesome. We also have a desert, which means there might be some temples. We have some piggies, some piggies for some food. Do we see sheep? Of course we don't see sheep. Oh, <gasps> there's sheep. Do you see that? There are sheep. Okay, first piece of wood, first thing. <laughs> it's gonna be birch. Every single solitary Minecrafter that I think I've ever seen hates this wood, which is ironic because I don't. I love this wood. P please, please go faster. I already miss my tools. I already miss my diamond tools. I'm probably also going to start missing my diamond armor as soon as it turns nighttime and I die. Let me get these planks here because my world spawn is over here somewhere. I'm just gonna mark it and we're gonna take some damage. We're intentionally gonna take lots of damage, watch. Ow, my ankles. Okay, so I probably should have made a sword because that'll make killing these sheep so much easier. We're excited about killing sheep. It's like the first thing that I wanna do ever. Every, t every time I start a new world, the first thing I wanna do is kill sheep. Look, I've, ooh, give me your sapling <laughs> so I can replant it and make more super ugly wood. Die, ha 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 ha. Give me your wool. <laughs> Oh no, there's a fire. Oh, this is, this does not bode well. This is a bad sign. Things are gonna go terribly. It's already trying to take all of my trees. Please, okay, good, 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 good. Pop this down, go ahead and make a bed cause that's the first thing that needs to happen at all ever in a series. Yep, mm-hmm. The bed is important, especially now. Those phantoms, those phantoms are terrifying. I remember a couple, few weeks ago, I guess, I hadn't really encountered them yet, you know, cause they were new. Put my stuff here. Cause that, that is not where I wanted that to go. I'm gonna be picky. Let's try that again. Better, okay. Um, a couple of weeks ago, uh, my better half and I were, were playing a game and I ran into phantoms for the first time. And they, of course, proceeded in completely murdering my face. I was really excited about that. Only not. So, yeah. You probably won't see me wanting to be up and about uh, during the nighttime. At all. Ever. And it's not because of the zombies, or the skeletons, or the witches, or even the, the, the craziness of the really quiet creeper. It's... The horrendously flying, screeching, you know, manta ray of the skies that is the phantom that's going to make me want to not be awake during the night times. Yep. Ooh, that's a good idea. I forgot about this, this little thought. Get us a little bit of food here. Uh, what else do I need? Please turn this off. Thank you. Oh, because <laughs> I'm like, why can't I make an axe? Because you don't have enough sticks. Duh. Okay, let's take a gander. Let's look around. We know we got trees. Some water. There, ooh, some reeds over there. I need to go get them. Some chickens. Nice desert. I'm not, I'm, I'm just taking a gander, trying to see if I can... There's a cave right there. I feel like there might be one over here. Should be running and bouncing around, wasting all my hunger and stuff. Let me go over here. Ooh, another sheep. Oh, and cows. Do I have more than one cow? Oh no. <gasps> Look at that. That's awesome. 
I will go over there in just a moment. Okay, we have a cave over here. That's good. We can get... See if we... Oh, look. <laughs> Those poor trees. <laughs> Rip trees. Alright, so we have a village to go and check out, which we will do momentarily. Let's get some... Get some basic resources here. Okay, let's go. I have no food. I have no food. It's okay. Let's head over here. Go, go. Make it fast. And I'm gonna do... I'm gonna... Let me... Let me... Nope, not what I want. Yep, mm-hmm. What I'm gonna do <laughs> is put this here so I can see it. Be like, hey... Oh, no. Genius. <laughs> genius so I can see it in that way I don't get totally lost I I can be pretty bad with my directions in this game I I can get lost very easily which is why I try to build on world spawn so I don't have to worry about getting lost I can just make a compass regardless of where I'm at and get straight back home what's going on over there oh is that an ocean oh cool might be able to find some boats and uh oh don't do that find some boats and what are those things called? The water temples? Guardian temples? Whatever. Well, I don't know. The things that make those really loud, spazzy monsters. So, we're going to raid their crops. See if there's a blacksmith such as that. Also look for books. Hey, bunny. Yeah, run away. Run away. I'm going to get you. I'm going to get you. These things are so spazzy. I love it. Fair amount of villagers over here. Pretty decent. Pretty decent village, I guess. Not the best thing in the world. I've seen bigger and better. But it's it's not always about the size, is it? Say, nope, it ain't. I don't know why I'm doing that. Is it nighttime yet? Doesn't look like it. What's this? Nothing useful. Although, that is a spawn problem waiting to happen, isn't it? The stars are out. Can I sleep? Yep. All right. This will keep our villagers safe. This bed all by itself. And then I don't have to worry about blocking them in or anything crazy like that. I'm just gonna, just gonna do this. And I guess see about letting this little guy out. There we go. All right. There we go. My, la my last torch. That, that is all I have to offer you because you have nothing to offer me. There's, there's no books. Come on, there we go. There's no books. No blacksmith, no free lava. I've got that back at my space. Yeah, there's nothing here. That's that's great, and I'm totally okay with that. Okay, what? Do I, oh, there, there's my pillar. See, I was about to get lost. I was about to run off into the des desert and die of starvation and thirst. I'm not sure if I want to go ahead and jump into that cave over there and go see what it has to offer. Or, you know what? Actually, yeah, let's do that. I'm going to grab this stuff and we're going to go set up in the cave. We'll leave this here so that I know where spawn is at because I'm probably going to build over here. That would be my preference. Oh, that's cool. Look at that. <laughs> His entire root system is based on that one block of earth. <laughs> ah, Minecraft. Ignoring reality one block at a time. Like literally ignoring reality. There, yeah. There, there's a whole entire. Yeah, never mind. I'm just not gonna go there. <laughs> We're not gonna talk about escapism <laughs> and games as used as such. That cave looks so dark and menacing. Oh my, that's just crazy. We'll see how the cave generation is on this world. I'm kind of curious because I, in my hard world, I had some really crazy cave generation where I was like really what is happening I promise I will go ahead and get the coal I'm not just gonna leave it I promise I just wanted to get the wood I would build over in this area well I mean I could do that I could build my 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 house or whatever over here next to <laughs> the yawning chasm that is that cave but I think I'm just going to go ahead and build it next to spawn. It makes life a little bit easier. Come on. Hurry. Oh, look, I got a new recipe. I, I can now make a, a block of coal. I bet is what it's telling me. 
I've got my two undestite. Need to keep those guys doing their own thing. Let's gather. Oh, I miss wood. That's not good. Oh, look at all the saplings. Good deal. That'll make starting a tree farming area very easy. This is so dark. It's got to be look, weird lighting glitches. This is why we love this game. It tries to terrify us and cool, glitchy, bizarre coding ways. It has nothing to do with the fact that that's exactly what the game wants to do. It has to do with the fact that it's a total and complete accident. But accidents are good sometimes. I don't know how, but they are. So I don't know that I necessarily have any plans for the series. If you have any thoughts or suggestions, please, uh, you know, let me know. I... <laughs> I can't say that I'm necessarily the most creative person when it comes to playing this game. Occasionally I'm like, hmm, what should I do in the game today? I don't know. I'm just not going to play. Um, and especially because, like I said in my introductory video, if you watched it, if you did not, that's fine. You didn't. <laughs> you probably didn't miss much. But like I said, I'm usually more of a function over form kind of person. So if I'm building something, it's usually because I want it to be there for a very specific purpose. It's not because I want it to look good. That, that, that means that I don't necessarily do just a lot of like random creative builds. Let me get the rest of these saplings here. All right. Is that a, oh, that's a skeleton. Even better. I'm looking forward to that guy. All right. This is, what am I looking for? This is what I'm looking for here. He's not coming at me, is he? No. Let me drop my stuff over here, slightly away from the cave of doom. There we go. How much coal did I get? Uh, here, we'll do this. We'll split it up a little bit like that. I will go ahead and make myself a chest so I can dump off some stuff that I don't necessarily need. Oh, really? Ugh, these grass blocks, man. They aggravate me. Put our seeds in there and our saplings and the cactus. Pretty much anything we don't need right now at this very second. I'll put in some of the wood so I don't have, like, all of it with me. Just in case, you know, terrible things happen and I get killed. Nope, this can go here. Oh, that's sandstone. A lone block of sandstone. Get out of here. The only food that I have to my name. We'll put this here. That could stay. The dirt, I guess, can hang out in here because I don't need it right now. Let's go ahead and cook this up, even though that's a waste of coal because that's only two items, not eight. But that's okay. I do need a new axe. There we go. And I'll go ahead and make another pick. Why not? I have to go up in here and deal with the skeleton, assuming he didn't despawn. Uh, sticks. All of the sticks. Make many sticks. And a full stack of torches, because that's what we need. We need all torches that we can have. Oh, of course it's getting dark. Okay, let me see. Is he still up in here? You still here, dude? No, he despawned, I guess. Or he moved way down here. Oh, with his friend. Oh, they hit super hard. Don't kill me. I will be upset. Oh, no. No, 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 no. Go, 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 go. Don't get dead. Don't get dead. Don't get dead. Oh, they're still shooting. Still shooting at my butt. Okay. Whew. All right. Let me, <laughs> let me get some of my food. I forget that they hit kind of hard, even in normal mode. Come on. Go, go, hearts. Hopefully the one skeleton killed his friend. That would be nice. Probably didn't happen that way, though. Come on. That's all the food that I have. <laughs> I have no more. Oh, no. Nobody over there. Okay. Let's see. They should still be down here, I would imagine. No? No? Evidently one of them got dead. Well, what happened to the other one? Okay, I don't know. The game is just being nice to me, I guess. Like, you almost died. <laughs> Here's your consolation prize. Let's head on up here. See if I can, uh... Too dark. <laughs> Try to light everything up like crazy. <gasps> oh, no. Oh, no. You, you go come around? Are they coming? Oh, is he coming? Oh no. Don't, don't let your friend kill me too. Oh, it's so dangerous. It's so dangerous. <laughs> I'm not 
going to let him kill me. I don't have any food. Oh, no. Oh, 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 oh. Are you going to come out in the sunlight? Oh, you almost got me. Oh, he's coming out in the sun. He is... He is... Determined. He is determined. Where's his friend? Oh, goodness. Oh, so bad. This is so terrible. And I, don't, I only had one apple. <laughs> I don't have any more food. I guess I'm gonna have to go kill some more stuff. All right, well, I've got eight pig meat, so that's good. Pork, I've got eight pork. <laughs> from now on, we will call it pig meat. Everything will be called by the animal meat that it came from, the animal that it came from. Chicken meat, cow meat, pig meat, sheep meat. <laughs> Oh, goodness. Let's see. Okay, go slow. Go slow. Is he still here? Is he still here? Oh, I saw that iron up there. Whoa. Okay. <laughs> load at the speed I need you to load. Oh, maybe this will take me to where the zombie is. Nope. Okay, that's fine. Regardless, we have found some iron. There was a little bit back here. Where's... Oh, there's a water source up there. I wonder if there's a cave up there too. Okay, where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Here's it. Here it is. We got it. We got some iron. Now the question is, what do we want to do with it first? I vote we're going to make some armor. Because <laughs> clearly I need it. I need some kind of protection against these crazies. I'm not in the habit of using shields. I apologize for that. I know that they're super good. You know, they can help save your life. But uh, personally, I find that they just get in the way. Like, they're all up in the way of, like, my screen. I can't see anything. Like, this whole entire left side area is just blocked up by the shield. All right, let's go cook this up and make our first piece of, of iron armor. Ooh, yeah. I'm going for the chest piece, I think, because uh, that's the biggest piece, the most expensive piece. Maybe they're right underneath us? That's what it sounds like. I don't know, whatever. We'll figure it out later. Yep, this is what we're doing. That, that is a thing that is happening. Heck yeah, first piece of armor. Yeah. Now, oh, don't throw your torches. Now I'll be less prone to death by a little tiny bit. Oh, I can't make anything else. <laughs> I guess I'll go ahead and make an iron pickaxe. I don't know. I'm going to sit on the iron for a minute. We'll figure it out. This is going to have to be the end of this episode. Hope you enjoyed it. Hope you come back for more. And uh, yeah, this is Abby of Creatively Lazy. And I will see you later in a manner of speaking. So long, farewell, have an excellent day.